Hey everyone, Brian Parker. I want to talk to you for just a minute about energy. Nowadays, a lot of people are looking for energy in the form of a supplement. Things like energy drinks and pre-workouts are incredibly common now and being used as fuel sources. But as we've discussed in our videos before, those are not always the safest option. What happens is when you combine stimulants inside of your body, what you do is you constrict blood vessel function. You start to cut off blood flow and oxygen flow, which is obviously pretty crucial. If you want to learn more about that, head to our All Me podcast and search our energy drink episode that we did with Dr. John Higgins. So if that's not the safest option, what we got to do is try to find some safer alternatives. And there's three of them that you can work on. Number one is sleep. Again, check out our podcast we did with Dr. Singh. You'll learn pretty quickly how crucial at least seven hours of sleep is for your body. If you don't get that, you will be looking for a fuel source somewhere, right? Also focus on a nutrition plan. If you're skipping meals or under fueled or going from dinner to lunch, 16 hours without something for your body to work off of, again, it's gonna be hard to get to the energy levels that you need and you might look for a product as a result. Hydration is another big one. Check out our podcast we did with our friends on Gatorade on that one. If you're not staying hydrated, that can lead to a lack of energy. So hydration, nutrition, and sleep are really the three crucial components to energy. Often difficult to do. They take a little more effort all right, than a product would, but they're gonna give you a safer solution to that energy issue that you might be looking for and slowly take away the need to take some of those risky products. If you got more questions about that, send us a message today or head to our website below.